mama told me One day I'ma grow up big and I'ma be a king And my papa told me It's okay to say what shit hurts Don't forget your dreams cause they'll get you through this So called life they call living but I call it strange And I bet I'll do it Cause I'm on my way and strong enough that yeah. I can shake the pain Hey what is up guys and welcome to my let's play of The Witch's House so I found this game on RPG Maker and I thought it was pretty cool so I thought we should check this out and uh, yeah, let's begin. Also I love the aesthetic and the atmosphere, it's really cool. So check this game out guys, it's free to play and it's an indie game. You know my love for indie games so let's check it out. We're in a forest, okay. Witch's house out of the forest. You're up, Anison. You're up, Anison, eh? Okay, so let's go out of the forest because, like, I don't want to go to the witch's house. Oh, roses. The way is blocked by starting a huge patch of roses. Well, it's good I see something shiny. How convenient. If I can find it. This way. Oh. Okay. Found something rusty and sharp. Machete. Just lying there. I feel like the witch left that there for us. Okay, let's try to use it. So we go to escape. Item. Okay then. Maybe we do have to go up. The game is called the witch's house after all. Holy crap, the cat vanished. God freaking damn it. Okay, maybe it can chop these up. Ah, sweet. I'm doing some gardening work. Because why not? <coughs> the machete broke. Okay. Oh, I see you. Huh? What is it? Hmm. So the way out so the way out is blocked up by the roses. Oh shit. You gonna go in? Might as well if you can't leave. Hell yeah, my dude. Alright, let's save. And thus we enter the witch's house. Let me just check around. I haven't checked around here. If there's anything. It's a pretty small house. Let's go in. Yup, I underestimated it. Yeah, I don't trust that blood. Nope. Come to my room. Uh. Oh wow, this expanded. Decided I'd follow you fluffs. Incidentally, where the heck you'd come from? Come out from. Oh yeah. There's no door. <laughs> That's weird. Alright, um, here's what we can do. Let's explore a vase of roses. Basket has a big teddy bear in it. There's a little bit of room left. Yeah, I'm not getting in there, sorry. Bears in the basket. Notice how it says plural. Alright. A large clock. Time marches on. You can also sprint in this game, by the way. See, it says opens when the when the house returns to normal. What do you mean normal? It's not lit. Hell yeah, it's lit. Teddy bear rests against the pile of presents. Take teddy bear. Okay. Oh, shit. A present fell from the pile. Wait, is there something to read? I was sick, so no one played with me. My father and my mother didn't love me. How convenient that you left your diary just sitting there. Oh yeah, I think I know what we have to do. Limbs make it too big to fix. So how do we get rid of the limbs? Let me see. 
save. I mean, guys, look at the, at, at the atmosphere of this game. Holy fuck, scissors. Yeah, that's that. Yep. That's creepy, but... Okay. Touch me. Item. Okay. Put the torso in the basket. How much fun. No, fuck off. Holy shit. Are you gone? Okay. God, that's creepy. I don't trust this place anymore. There's teddy bear limbs on the ground. Oh, how fun. I love this. Isn't this really fun little house? Adorable, ain't it? What does this say? Taste the poison. How about now? I'm assuming that being the poison. Wine bottles are lined up on the shelf. Okay. Fireplace. Look inside, why not? You'll get soot on your face, probably. Yep. What's that say? The cook is busy. Lend a hand. Ah. Uh, ooh. I have an idea. Oh. Just get out of here. I'm stuck on this thing. Ha, dead. Talk. Do nothing. Item. There you go. We got a silver key. Sweet, what does this say? A book titled Dining of Aristocrats. People of ruling and wealthy classes have long enjoyed dining with silverware. By using such hard to clean cutlery, they could hire servants to demonstrate their wealth. In addition, silver utensils change colour upon contact with poison, making them quite useful. Wait. That's a silver key. Wait, we have poison on the table. Hold on, I have an idea. Okay. Don't. Item. Silver key. Mmm, it said on contact, so put key in suit. The key turned black in the soup. Hard and unlocking. I swear I saw something there. That's weird, guys. Shit. Dude, there's something not normal going on here. This ain't right. Hey cook. Oh shit, the cook is gone. A cutting board covered with scratches. And the book is closed. Well, seems like you're done for the day. That sounds like it was yummy. Wait, let me check if... Line the tableware glasses and seasonings. Nothing particularly eye-catching. What about those tomatoes? We need some respect for the tomatoes. Door opened. Okay. Oh, I see someone. Is that the witch? Okay. First of all, let's save. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, I'm leaving this place quick. Take. All right. Shit. Excuse me. 
You thought it moved slightly. Must be your imagination. You fucking move. Don't lie to me. Do not lie to me. Oh god. A book titled The Witch's House 2. Read. The form of the house changes based upon the witch's magic. Oh. A book titled The Witch's House 1. Keys do not open doors in the witch's house. Something else must serve as a key. What could that be? Uh, <coughs> a book titled A Funny Story. Once upon a time, there was a rich man pulling along a cart full of treasure. His cart had broken down in the woods, but there came a passing hunter and his dog. The rich man pleaded to the hunter to keep a close eye on his cart, to which the hunter agreed. The rich man went to get a new cart. Meanwhile, the hunter kept watch. Night soon fell, and the hunter grew worried for his elderly mother still at home. So the hunter told the dog to watch the cart and went home to check on his mother. When the man returned, he saw the dog on guard. So he gave the dog a reward for his master, a silver coin to carry in his mouth. The dog ran all the way from home and brought his master to the coin. But the hunter flew into a rage. Sorry, I can't read today. I told you to watch the cart, and what did you do? You saw from it. So the master killed the dog. So, so funny, dude. Totally. Hilarious. Oh, shit. I just saw myself in the mirror. That's cool. So many roses. I have, a feel I have a feeling the roses have a hidden meaning because in the last version of the game there weren't roses. And I first played this. So, that's interesting. Yeah. Talk. Oh, I can give you my rope. Item. Rope. Give me this. Give rope. Yep, I'm not reading that. Sorry, bud. We save. We go back down. Models of insects are lined up inside the glass. Okay. There's a blue winged butterfly model in the case. There was a green one there before, too, in the other room. Shit. The glass case holds what looks like a human head. The case is cracked. Okay, then. A picture of a white cat done with wool. Cute. I think. Dusty bookshelf full of cobwebs. Nothing of note here. Okay. Maybe the cobwebs? I don't know. A painting of a lady with her parasol by a room. And... Oh, a book is missing. I can give you a book. Nope. No thanks. Okay. Had the lid of a glass case coming off. Well guys, I think this is going to conclude this episode. Let me know if you want to see more, if you like this, and uh, see you guys in the next video. Peace.